It's build time! I have the parts, I've unboxed them, and now it is time to begin my journey towards uh, not so much Twitch streaming, fandom, fame. There's a word in there that I want, but can't think of it because it's warm in this room. I don't know, it's gonna make me something, and we're gonna get started. I'm very excited, let's do this. I'm just about to get started, and as I'm getting ready to put in the CPU, I noticed that there is a little bit of thermal paste right here already on what's a brand new motherboard, which I find fascinating. And I can't tell if I'm having a belated case of the Mondays and accidentally smeared it on there or what. In any case, this is quite the mystery to me. Doesn't harm anything, but I'll be wondering about this for the rest of the build. So this isn't my first Ryzen build, but I still want to throw a shout out to AMD because I really love this lever and latch system. So these are the latches right there, there's one right here, and there's a little lever that secures it all. And it's just, it's really elegant, it's easy, well relatively easy to get on, relatively easy to get off, far superior to Intel's stock cooler, which has that weird post and lock into the motherboard good luck trying to remove it without breaking anything system. Okay, I am done putting in the CPU, the RAM, and the M.2 drive. Uh, one thing I want to say about this motherboard is that I super dig having four DIMM slots. I don't often see that on a Micro ATX board and uh, it's a nice feature to have. So this is pretty cool, check this out. NZXT includes all of the screws in separate packages that are labeled. I really dig this, you know, along with their zip ties and everything, it's a really tidy little package. Yeah, so guess who just tried to put in the power supply? modular power supply without connecting any of the necessary cables first. Yep, that would be me. Let's not tell Gordon about this one because I feel like there's gonna be a big fat I told you so in there somewhere. All right, I'm finally done. Don't really have too much to say about the build overall. Um, definitely having a case of the Mondays because as I was putting this all together, definitely several moments where I decided, or realized rather, that what I was doing was not in the right order for doing things efficiently. So I had to pull things out, put things back together, so on and so forth. The, uh, the cable management didn't really pay a lot of attention to it this time. Um, one thing I do kind of wish I had sprung for are custom cables because this right here, I'm not a big fan of. Anyway, I'll just have to live with it. Whew, I am finally done after a lot of stupid mistakes. Just really, I didn't think out certain things and you can see me go, hmm, nope, gotta redo that. Anyway, I am done with having a case of the Mondays on not a Monday. And I can now move on to the next step, which is putting an operating system on this beautiful thing. I mean, I really do love this purple-white scheme. Okay, I'm finally done. Well, I'm done putting on the operating system and some benchmarks and running all of that really briefly. But oh boy, was it a journey getting there because, I have a story for you. Um, so when I put together the parts list about, what, over a month ago, I specifically told myself, hey, you're gonna be dropping a second gen Ryzen part into that motherboard. It's probably going to need a BIOS update. Don't forget to update the board before you build. Well, guess who didn't leave herself a note and built the whole system and then had to tear it back down so that she could flash the motherboard because it wasn't posting. If you guessed me, you'd be correct. In any case, uh, right now I, I have a system that's up and running and smells a lot, a lot like thermal paste remover. 
In fact, it was so bad <laughs> that Gordon asked me uh, what orange thing I was eating in the lab. <laughs> yeah, good times, everybody. In any case, I'm finally done with this part and I'm looking forward to putting on OBS or XSplit or, well, I don't know. It's gonna be part of the journey. I'm gonna figure out what's happening next. So stay tuned for that and I will catch you soon. I will catch you all soon. This is getting deleted anyway.